Have you ever woken up to a beautiful day and you realize you have the whole day to yourself? But then you have to decide which quad should I bring out? I wish I could bring everything. But now, you can. Stay tuned. What is up FPV fam? It's your boy, Dopey FPV, and welcome back to my channel. This is my Low Pro Quad Gut BPX3. I love this bag so much. It's actually my one and only bag ever since I started FPV. So it's been five years that I've been rocking this bag and I love it so much. And coming from a reputable camera bag brand, you know they have the experience to do the best bags that can withstand the test of time. And this is still gonna be my daily driver because it makes me look OG, man. They have discontinued this. So the only place you can find a brand new one, which you can, or oh, you can find a second-hand one is on eBay. This bag can fit three quads inside. Okay, I hate hanging my quads outside because I don't want to tell the whole world I am an FPV pilot. But yeah, because of its depth, that's what I love about it. You can put three quads inside, uh, your tools, your lipo, your propeller, and all that shit. And it's all well hidden. But on some days, like you are... Uh, excluded from social gatherings your friends didn't invite you to a party or your wife is out with her girls and you have the whole day to yourself you just want to fly more quads you want to bring your whole fleet and you need something bigger this just doesn't cut it one bag came along and i was like oh this is the one but i didn't pull the trigger because it's not really a need but then black friday came along and i was like damn the price was such at a steal that i just had to get it which bag am i talking about it's the Whoop! HGLRC backpack. Yeah, boy, this bag is huge. So, I'm gonna show you what can be fitted inside this bag, how big it is, because of course they have dimensions online, but sometimes you can't really tell how big it is until you see someone put their shit in it. So, this is not a review, I'm not sponsored or anything. Got this with my own mula. I'm not gonna go through the materials or the track count and if you're not an FP pilot you can also uh, get something out of this video because you can see how big it is and if you're a content creator you're just gonna put your gimbals your uh, camera your lens or whatever and they also come with like dividers so yeah they provided eight dividers four small ones and four big ones and you can just organize your stuff accordingly but i'm not gonna do that i'm just gonna fill this guy to the brim to maximize just assume that i'm a nut job and i'm gonna like pack this bag with quads so let's go let's get it whoop all right check it out dopey fpv yeah okay i'm just gonna go through compartment by compartment and show you how the bag looks like from inside and what can be fitted into the bag and is fitted even a word i don't even know what can fit inside this bag and also like the features i love about it okay so you can see my handsome face right now i have no top down camera too so just bear with me with this old school type of video so the first thing is this top compartment that my low, low pro doesn't have this is the first thing that i love about this bag basically it's a compartment that is separated from the main compartment which is at the bottom and it's quite deep it's like really significant in size and of course if you're an FPV pilot what do you put here yep your radio and your goggles and I got like a bunch of stuff at the side so you're gonna see me like taking stuff from here radio of choice boxer by radio master the best radio of 2023 just gonna put that inside and of course what else do you need you need your goggles baby goggles of choice dji goggles 2 and as you can see fits nicely and there's still space so like i said assume i'm a nut job right now i'm gonna like fill this bag to the brim which is not so practical but maybe you just feel like bringing everything, all your systems. Which brings me to my Skyzone goggles. These are analog goggles. Like with the Avatar uh, VRX. So, there's three systems now. Digital, 
avatar and analog i'm just gonna put it like wait i'm gonna put the bigger goggles below and the smaller goggles on top and of course when you bring your analog what do i usually fly with analog uh my tiny whoops baby and my favorite tiny whoop the beta fpv meteor 75 pros just gonna go here i'm not even like gonna organize it i'm just gonna dump it everything dump everything inside okay so yeah three quarts down two goggles one radio that's the top portion done let's move on to the main compartment another feature that i love about this bag is how the top compartment opens up it's just like that Whoop. check it out now you have access to the main compartment without having to remove your quads if you hang it outside so with my low pro if i do hang it outside i need to lay it down to access everything inside but in order to do that i need to remove my quads but with this my quads can remain here i can grab what i need inside and the best thing is because of this uh, strap here your quads won't even touch the ground it just hangs like that how cool is that okay so let's go to the main compartment what can i put i'm not even gonna touch my fpv quads for now because <coughs> I've already planned this out for my travel. Firstly, my DJI Mini 4 Pro. And wait, let me see. If, if you don't believe me that it's inside, I'm just gonna show you. So this is my Mini 4 Pro, uh, the radio, and three batteries. I'm not even like gonna take it out and organize it properly with the dividers. I'm just gonna put it in, the whole bag in. That's how easy it is. So, that's my DJI Mini 4 Pro. I got my DJI Avatar. This is just a random toilet bag that is filled with my Avatar system. So, there's another radio. There's the Avatar and there's three batteries for the Avatar. Again, you're probably gonna save more space if you organize everything nicely. But, I'm just gonna dump the whole bag here. And, what else do... I need my tool bag. Tool bag, baby. So, you probably don't have this big of a tool bag. Probably you just have like a smaller one with just your screwdriver, your prop guards, uh, your prop tool or whatever. But, yeah. I have like a huge ass tool bag with like 90% of things that I don't use. There's like spare arms, spare motors, soldering kit and all that shit. I'm just going to dump it inside. And of course, with quartz, you need lipo. Torval, baby. Only the best lipo bag. And yeah, I got a bunch of lipos here. Okay. Uh, so let's see if this fits. Lipos always go at the base because it's the heaviest. You don't want them to crush your other things. Check it out. I got four mini bags inside this huge ass bag. Show you guys. DJI Mini 4, Avatar, tool bag, lipo. That's all for the main compartment. Now let's get to the fun part where we pack or we strap up our FPV quads. So there's three quads. I mean, there's three straps up front. There's one on top. There's one on each side. And yeah, that's it. So it's one, two, three, four, five, six. Meaning, you can strap six quads, baby. Six quads. Let's open this up. And the buckles are magnetic. So it's not those old school type. You just like touch them together. And they're pretty strong. So for the purpose of demonstration, I'm just going to grab all my five inch quads right here oh no my light just died okay my light just went kaput i don't know what happened but i'm just gonna go on because i don't want to repeat all this all over again so yeah let's strap up my 
5 inch quads and I'm probably just gonna time lapse this alright that's 3 quads up front like that I'm gonna strap one to the side and grabbing one more on the other side so that's what five yep and again for the purpose of this video we're gonna go crazy baby we're gonna go crazy we're gonna put two three inch quads at the top just to make it an even number of a total of how many quads do you count 12 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 3 tiny whoops 7 8 9 10 1 avatar 1 dji mini 4 pro that's like 12 quads baby yep and there's like 3 radio two goggles that's just insane and there's like a uh, strap at the bottom okay because the lights off probably can't see it but there's a strap for a bigger tripod that you can put or your field chair if you are a pilot and yeah at the sides here maybe you can put your propellers so i'm just gonna put my propeller back here there's even another zip uh, compartment which I'm not gonna use. Yeah, they, they have like a z elastic compartment here and also one more zip compartment where you can put, I don't know, your action cameras and stuff. And maybe you can put a little tripod just like that and strap it up together with your quad. And, 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 and. Oh man sucks that the light is out but there's this technology here with the strap that can extend out if you want it to so you have like a support system that doesn't make it too heavy so you can see there's buckles i mean there's straps here too where you can just tighten and loosen as you like so when you carry it this thing is going to be heavy but when you carry it you're not going to feel much of the weight so that's cool and on the side here you have like a velcro thingy so you can just choose your velcro of choice and just put it there they have like a see-through slot here where you can put maybe your name card uh it doesn't fit i wanted to put this but yeah you know how fpv pilots always get lucky <laughs> not all right so now I'm gonna try to carry it. Whoa! Remember, always take your props out, guys. Don't cut yourself, don't cut others. Tighten it. Surprisingly, it doesn't feel heavy at all. Check it out. I would break my back if I carry this much stuff on my low pro, but hey, this feels good. So this strap technology actually works. Baby, this bag is insane. It's gonna be my new favorite bag for travel because I, I know I can fit all my stuff. I'm not gonna be out at the field and thinking like, shit, I should have brought that. But now I have everything. And if you like this video, remember to sub, like, share, and comment down below whether I've inspired you to get this bag, okay? This is Dopey FPV, and I'll see you on the next pack. Bye-bye!